All right then, guys. Just had this pigeon with a slingshot straight through the eye with an eight mil steel. Uh, Goblet Evo, precise. I'm not too sure on this thickness, but it's 24 to 19 taper. Just shot this uh, really nice pigeon. As you can see, straight through the eye, eight mil steel. Nice, lovely clean shot. We're gonna get a catch and cook done on this one. We'll cook this one up. So yeah, stay tuned. All right, guys. So I just skinned my pigeon, plucked them off, cut the meat off with my multi-tool. Got it in my bag here. So yeah, we'll take this back and do a catch and cook when I get home. They cook it up. Uh, show you guys what I do with it. So yeah, stay tuned. Just got home. Uh, just cleaned out the pigeon. Spread it under some cold water. Cut it up into nice strips so it'll cook quicker. Uh, this actually is really nice meat pigeon meat, guys. If you haven't tried any of it, I've had some people comment on my videos whether it's nice meat. Yes, it is. It's really nice. It tastes a lot like steak, in my opinion. I'm using my normal recipe, some garlic granules, and I'm going to add some mixed herbs as well because I added some herbs last time. It made it taste really nice. So I'm using that again. Just got the pan here. It's preheated with some oil in it. And we're just to uh, just get it going, and guys. Got the pigeon in the pan, and I keep turning this and shaking it around till it's all brown on the outside and throughout. Just like I said, like a steak earlier, and then it uh, should be done. I'm just going to sandwich with some barbecue sauce. Um, haven't yet added the garlic granules or the herbs. Oh, all the herbs. I'll add them in a little minute. But yeah, I'll uh, get back to you when I've done that. So we have the pigeon cooking in the garlic granules and the herbs. I'm going to sprinkle them on top. Got like a little nice sauce that's sitting in as well from the leftover bits. Do nice garlic granules with a sprinkle these on. And then the herbs, just put these on my hand and sprinkle them out. But yeah, been pretty good. It smells really good, guys. A nice simple recipe and it tastes delicious as well. And obviously the sandwich with some barbecue sauce, really good. Can't beat this one. Nice pigeon sandwich. Um, this pigeon was taken with the Goblet Evo. A really nice frame. I actually had another pigeon while I was walking back home, uh, but that one's in my, that's got, that's got in my sleeve. Shot, Goblet Evo, nice big one, yeah. Goblet Evo, precise bands, 24 to 19 cut. Uh, eight mil steels, another one dropped down to that. Nice shot. I'm gonna clean that one up after this, get that one in my freezer for another time. Uh, but yeah, hope you guys are enjoying it. I'm really loving this frame. I look out for another review. Got a bit of barbecue sauce on my finger. Look out for another review. Um, coming soon, I have a more in-depth review of this frame. I really like it. But yeah, just fed myself with the slingshot. Nice pigeon, no meat going to waste. So yeah, thanks for watching all. Cheers for all the support and stay safe. Thank you. So guys, I'm actually unsure on the thickness of band I was using in this video, but I know it was precise yellow um and cut it, it was cut 24 to 19 taper so i made the band set but i got actually got the precise band sent out to me so i wasn't too sure on the thickness but soon i know i'll be using 0.65 precise band 24 to 19 with eight mil steels that's gonna be my next setup guys thanks for watching